here today with foster mom Jill and her little foster charge Kobe. Kobe showed up at Animal Welfare League in Chicago as a stray and um, his owner was actually located but she did not want to pay his redemption fee so he sort of languished at Animal Welfare League until Karen Rescue USA took him. Um, Jill, tell us about Kobe. What's his personality like? Oh, he's very loving. He loves to be held and petted. Um, we're kind of guilty of letting him sleep in the bed with us, so he loves that. He likes getting under the covers. Uh, he's very, actually, he's pretty good at being potty trained he, if you have him on a schedule. Uh huh. We keep him loose in the house during the day. Okay. And leave at 8.30 and come home at about quarter to five. And there's been no accidents, but he does have to go out right away then. So tell me how he is with other dogs. Um, I believe he'll be pretty good. We have a dog next door to us, but he's fenced and Kobe's fenced, but they run up and down and tease each other and bark. If one sees one, they go running to the fence right away and play. Uh-huh. Well, that's um, good. So he could probably be in with another yeah. dog. Yeah, I believe so. Great. And you, I, know, I know you have children. You right. have older teenagers. And how does he do with the kids? Oh, great. He loves the older kids. I don't know about little kids because we don't have any in the family either. Yep. So that I'm not sure of. Uh, but he, get, he loves the older kids. As long as you're giving him attention, he's happy. And we should mention, Kobe is very, he's still a young boy. He absolutely, whoever adopts him will need to take him through right. obedience training. He's got a yeah, lot of energy. He, he sees a squirrel, he'll go after it, or any birds, or anything he thinks he could go into. Absolutely, and that's because he's a Karen Terrier.